with all that uh, water that came down uh, that created damage to a lot of the trails that we enjoy around here. Okay, your favorite hiking huh. path might look different this year. Why you're advised to proceed on all trails with caution in our Channel 2 News <laughs> Victoria What's 5. What's doing? That was cautious, right? Right? A ninja right there. Yeah. It's, it's warming up outside and people are starting to hit the beaten path, obviously. Mm -hmm. Good evening. I'm Kristen Revington. And I'm Landon Miller. Thank you for joining us this afternoon. And while you are out hiking this year, officials want you to be a little bit more aware of the terrain. For that, we sent it out to Ryan Canada, who's live at Hunter Creek. So, Ryan, how's our winter affected the path there? Landon, it's just all the water that's out here. I mean, just take a look at the Hunter Creek going on and check this out. I mean, look at all that water. In fact, there used to be a wooden board that would help people get from one side to the other, but now the water is so strong, hikers are having to improvise. With shoes in hand, some hikers hit the Hunter Creek Trail barefoot today. Crossing this creek has always been a part of the popular hike, but this year the flow of water is faster. The creeks are higher than normal and you know the trails may have erosion. In fact, sections of the Hunter Creek landscape are currently missing, creating a higher risk of falls that can lead to injury. We're working on some of the repairs now and, and uh, some of the repairs will start uh, you know, later this year. Most of the damage has already been assessed, except for the higher elevations that are still under snowpack. We may not be seeing the, you know, sections of the Tahoe Rim Trail until July or August. No matter the trail, hikers are advised to pay close attention to their surroundings, especially what's underneath you. Also, know your skill set. Experts say your normal routes may be unfamiliar this year, but depending on your expertise, Damaged trails don't have to stop you. Go in there and you know be out enjoying nature, but just understand that you know the trails may have new hazards this year, and uh, to keep an eye out for them. And two hikers were in need of rescue just last weekend. One of them right here on the Hunter Creek Trail tonight at 5:30. We'll hear some safety tips from not just the sheriff's office, but also some from, from some fellow hikers. Covering the story live, Ryan Kennedy, Channel 2 News.